vertical force in the golf swing is one of the most important forces that a golfer utilizes to generate swing speed. What the vertical force that we're talking about in the golf swing is that vertical force that's occurring on the lead leg. The very best players utilize vertical force very early on in the downswing, meaning once they load up on the trail side, as they start to kind of move that force to the lead side, there's a time period where they're gonna actually create this really nice explosive movement that's gonna come from the vertical force. It's gonna help straighten out that lead leg a little bit. It's gonna help you do this motion and create a ton of power in the golf swing. When you look at the long drive guys, you know, the men and women on tour that really generate a lot of swing speed, you'll sometimes actually see that on their very fastest shots, that lead leg will actually lift up off the ground. That is a great indication of them using a ton of vertical force because force causes motion. And as they produce that force, uh, as they produce it really high, that foot actually will lift a little bit off the ground, showing that they've utilized a lot of vertical force. Now, one of the very best ways that I've seen to train that vertical force is actually with the super speeds protocols. As I have golfers go through those protocols, I look at their pre post vertical force measurements. Those are forces that change and increase by 12 to 13% just as a result of training with the super speed products. Now, there are other ways to train vertical force, wonderful ways to train it, but this is a very efficient and effective way to train that vertical force. The other thing to really consider with vertical force is that amateur golfers on tendency tend to be way too late peaking this vertical force. Meaning by the time they peak their vertical force, they're already down at the impact zone, which means they can't take that force and pass it out the body and out to the club and generate swing speed. So we want golfers to not just generate more vertical force, we want them to generate that force earlier in the swing. This is where some of my favorite drills that we utilize are the step drills. What the step drill is really trying to get you to do is feel that force going to the lead leg very early on in the swing. Of course, I love measuring these things in my lab, and so when I have golfers do this step drill, what I see is an increase not only in the magnitude of that vertical force, meaning they're pushing down, down on the ground harder, ground pushes up on them harder, but they also start producing that force much earlier in the swing. It's peaking a ton earlier. Then when I can get them back into their normal swings, I see drastic improvements in that force, increases in swing speed, the ball goes farther. So this is a great way to think about the vertical force, why it's important, and how we can utilize it to hit the ball further.